All right. Everybody ready? First wedding performed at Tremont Tavern. By uh, one of the greatest couples that's ever been here. We all love and care about. So let's get them married. So thank you. We're gathered here today to celebrate one of life's greatest moments, to give recognition to the worth and beauty of committed marital love, and to add to our best wishes to the words which shall unite Michael and Gail in marriage. The commitment that the two of you are about to make is the most important commitment that two people can make. You are about to create something new, the marriage relationship, an entity that never ends. As you stand here today, are you now prepared to give this commitment to one another? I am. Have you come here freely and without reservation to give yourselves to each other in marriage? Yes. Michael and Gail, I would ask that you both remember to treat yourself and each other with dignity and respect, to remind yourselves often of what brought you together today. Give the highest priority to the tenderness, gentleness, and kindness that your marriage deserves. If each of you will take responsibility for the quality of your life together, it will be marked by abundance of <laughs> feedback. And feedback. <laughs> <laughs> and we all know Gail can give you feedback. <laughs> Positive feedback. So. Yes, yes. Here, here. Uh, I'll state that again. It will be marked by abundance and delight. Michael Mark McDade, will you have this woman to be your wedded wife? I will. Will you love and comfort her, honor and keep her, in sickness and in health, and forsaking all others, keep yourself only unto her as long as you both shall live? I will. Gail Susan Lindsay, will you have this man to be your wedded husband? I will. Will you love and comfort him, honor and keep him, in sickness and in health, and forsaking all others, Keep yourself only unto him as long as you both shall live. I do. Since it is your intention to enter into this marriage, join your right hands and declare your consent before these witnesses by repeating after me. Alright, Mike, you repeat after me. I, Michael, take you, Gail. I, Michael, take you, Gail. To be my wife. To be my wife. To have and to hold from this day forward. To have and to hold from this day forward. For better or for worse. For better or for worse. For richer or for poor. For richer or for poor. In sickness and in health. In sickness and in health. To love and to cherish. To love and to cherish. As long as we both shall live. As long as we both shall live. Okay, Gail. Okay. I, Gail, take you, Michael. I, Gail, take you, Michael. To be my husband. To be my husband. To have and to hold. To have and to hold. From this day forward. From this day forward. For better or for worse. For better or for worse. For richer or for poor. For richer or for poor. In sickness and in health. In sickness and in health. To love and to cherish as long as we both shall live. To love and to cherish as long as we both shall live. Michael and Gail, and so much as the two of you have agreed to live together in matrimony, have promised your commitment to each other by these vows and the joining of your hands by the authority vested in me in the state of Tennessee, I now pronounce you husband and wife. <laughs> Kiss the bride. Yeah. Finally, finally. Thank you all very much. Thank you, Cardin Smith, for performing the ceremony. Thank you all for being here.